Good morning, beautiful people of God. This morning devotion is entitled Unseen Wonder by Mark DeHaan. Though you have not seen him, you love him. And even though you do not see him now, you believe in him. 1 Peter chapter 1, verse 8. In the twilight years, Miss Goodrich's thoughts came in and out of focus, along with memories of her challenging and grace-filled life. Sitting by a window overlooking the waters of Michigan's Grand Traverse Bay, she reached for her notepad. In words she soon would not recognize as her own, she wrote. Here I am in my chair, with my feet on the sill and my heart in the air. The sun struck waves on the water below in constant motion to where I don't know. But thank you, dear Father above, for your innumerable gifts and your undying love. It always amazes me, how could it be that I am so in love with one I cannot see? The Apostle Peter acknowledged such wonder. He had seen Jesus with his own eyes, but those who would read his letter had not. Though you have not seen him, you believe in him and are filled with an inexpressible and glorious joy. We love Jesus not because we are commanded to, but because with the help of the Spirit, we begin to see how much he loves us. It's more than hearing that he cares for people like us. It's experiencing for ourselves the promise of Christ to make the wonder of his unseen presence and spirit real to us at every stage of life. Our reflection for today, please read 1 Peter 1 verses 3 through 9 again. In what ways does the word show you how our God makes the inexpressible real to us? How open are you to the spirit of Jesus who lives in and among us? Let us pray. Our gracious God in heaven, please help me to see the miracles of your love and presence in your son and to believe in your spirit. Amen. Once again, I'm going to encourage you to subscribe to this channel today. Please pass this devotion to five people and encourage them to subscribe as well. God bless you and you have a great day.